Alright. Young Justice, coming from a recommendation from my very own friend Vinny. He said this game is fucking horrible. So, it's basically based off the Young Justice TV series, which is a show where all the Justice League characters are little kids. So, he said it's almost like a Marvel Ultimate Alliance, but just really, really bad. So, let's find out. Well, for a 2013 game, I already see the graphics are up to par. Why would anyone kidnap an archaeologist? Ooh, is she rich? What? I don't care if she's got money. I just figure knowing the motive might help. They're doing a really good job making my favorite superhero, as you can see in the background, uh, making him a total asshole. Nightwing looks pretty cool, though. Oh, boy. Here we go. We're in. When our game developer is going to realize chaining between X and Y will not work, it is the most boring shit you could do for a fucking video game, and it's the easy way out for any superhero game. I hate it so fucking much. Like, see, the thing is, is that this worked with Marvel Ultimate Alliance because Marvel Ultimate Alliance was awesome and it was from 2006, so combining X and Y and B worked. In this, a 2013 game, it doesn't work. Oh wait, I can pick up items too. Wow, this is a clone. Gee, I wonder what's behind all these breakable objects in this corner of the map. There could not be a, some type of collectible, could there? Oh, gee, I didn't see that one coming. Whoa, yeah. Can we just take a second? Uh, I don't even have anything to say about that. Did that look like a collectible to you, or did that look like a fucking ambient little just random object in the map? Old RT. Oh boy. This could not be exactly like a game I played. Oh, which one is it? Don't get me wrong, it's cool. I like the idea, but it's such a dated idea. Look at that. Look at the bars on the left. I'm not losing any health, I'm not losing any powers as I'm spamming this shit. I'm just literally just fucking ruining these things without an issue. Oh, but it's a kid's game, Maddie. I don't care. What about people like me who watch the cartoon? Or, not me, I'm saying, but my friend Vinny. He's my age, he watches this cartoon. There are still older age people. Don't fucking go off a target audience. For all games, it must be for the hardcore and the core. Ew! ew. Look at his... His RTY attack. That's the weirdest shit I've ever seen. Now, this is something like the Flash would do. What the fuck is this RTY thing? Sends out just a few little clones of him. The only thing inventive that this game brings compared to Marvel Ultimate Alliance is the fact that I can focus on one character at a time and my whole team doesn't have to be on screen for me to be doing something. And that's good. But that's also something I expect in a game from 2013 as well. Look at that UI. Just look at that. Like, I... Oh my god. Just like plain white text, no design, just... I got an A, I guess. Okay. Aqualad, Kid Flash. Let's get Superboy. And you know, that's that's just another clear-cut clone move on Marvel Ultimate Alliance. That's what I'm more so upset about. Can you even fly? What kind of super shit is this? Wait a sec, so I think with every character, it's like... RTA is a buff. Then RTX is a throwing move. And then you can switch RTY is like a direct, you know, projectile attack. And then RTB is like a radial attack. See? RTB. And then RTB is her reign of arrow. So basically every character isn't even unique in its own right, they're all just literal clones of each other with different skinned on attacks and animations and whatnot. Oh wait, I have a box to throw at you. I missed somehow, okay. Another mashing X scenario. It's not even like the game's like really bad, because in all honesty it wouldn't be that bad if Marvel Ultimate Alliance didn't exist. But it's just so boring, because I played the shit out of Marvel Ultimate Alliance, like, so much of that game. I've, played, I've beaten that game at least five times. And coming to a game like this, where they haven't just innovated on their ideas at all, aside from a camera, it's just painstakingly boring. And there's less invisible walls, I'll give it that. Oh, remember that thing I said about invisible walls? My bad. 
and on top of that with superpowers. It's like they literally, they, there's no any enemy archetypes. There's different skins, there's different colors and stuff, but there's, you know, guns and, and melee attacks, but there's literally no difference in what these enemies are doing to me. Look how complicated it is to find an upgrade system, or at least I think it is. And, you know, I'm looking for an upgrades tab or something along those lines, not profile. And under here, you can spend these hero points you get when you level up on these abilities. And then I guess you get credits from God knows fucking where. And you can spend them on Wayne Tech upgrades. Oh, it's a boss fight. Let's see if this gets any more complicated. Actually, it might. I'm not even going to lie. Ah, this is so easy. Oh, wait, he's about to die? It's all good. I'm going to pat him on the back. Oh, she's dead now? It's all right. I'm going to pat her on the back. Oh, he's dead now? gonna give him a little tap on the back. He's alright now. It's all good. No penalty, no nothing. Oh, he's dead. Pat on the back. Everything's okay now. God, what a fucking joke. There's literally no difference to these upgrades at all. Like, oh, multiple batterings or something along those lines. Or pulling multiple enemies for your grap grapnel gun kick. No, it's just more damage. More damage. More damage because I guess these fucking developers don't have brains and you know they copied a lot from Marvel to Alliance I don't know why they couldn't copy like upgrade variations and stuff because I mean that's not a bad thing at all I would like that today it's ringing arrows here we go another superhero game trope they're out of fucking audio cues so they reuse the same one over and over I can't play with her anymore Oh boy, they got mini guns. I bet my powers will definitely stop them because there is no difference in enemy types in this game and it's clear that they all do the same fucking damage towards me. He does two damage. He probably got a smidge more health. God, more enemies, dude. The combat in this game is fucking horrible. Holy shit. Oh, good positioning, game. You totally put your own enemy behind where he can't hit me at all. Good job, game. There were enemies coming down, and I canceled it because I saved the hostages too fast. That's unfucking real. That was some of the cheesiest fucking cutscenes and work I've ever seen. Oh god, I just realized what she's fucking doing. Is she really just pointing an invisible gun? What kind of... There's nothing virtually epic about that. Why doesn't she have her fucking crossbow out? Why is she pointing her fingers as a gun? Holy crap, she's the only person with different things. Healing, duration, and cooldown, and then damage. Mind blown, they fucking got the hint when they started making these characters that one of them needs to be a little different. I'm surprised she's pointing a bow at him and not her invisible gun. <laughs> Some cheesy shit. Wow, he dodged it. Oh shit! Like I'm trying to be a little kid and act like I'm fascinated, but I think even the little kid me would just be like, "This is fucking stupid." Ow, ow, ow! Hey, I would like to. All right, that's some bullshit. Oh my god, this move isn't even that he's doing is good. It just paralyzes you and he just fucking smacks the shit out of you. Oh my god, that move is just so fucking annoying because I can't move when he hits me with it. It does nothing to me. So why do you paralyze me? I'm done. I'm done. This game is so fucking boring that it's one of the worst games I've played in recent memory. Like, it is a clone of a game I binged to fucking death when I was a kid. And it's just insulting it now with the boring story, copycat, clone gameplay. None of the, the enemy or the allies are different. It's just awful because I'm like half asleep in my fucking chair as I'm playing this. And I, I just need to get up and go do something before I pass out. I'm, I'm extremely tired now. But um, yeah, whatever horrible games you want me to play, be sure to let me know in the comments down below. Hope you guys enjoyed. Other than that, stay sexy, stay active. I love you all.